Okay, welcome. Kalamaka Fly Fishers, Thursday night fly tying. Okay, we're going to do a realistic fly today. It's going to be a mosquito. So I've got the 140 Ultra Thread White. I'm going to just put it on here behind the eye, I think. Yeah, something like that. Okay, let's cut this off here. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to build this up. This is going to make his storage tank. Spin, spin your thread there once in a while. And keep the thread nice and flat. You can use a 70 watt thread, but it just takes a little longer to build this up. So this works a little better. So just build it up, something like so. Okay. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to whip finish that there. Okay, so it's like so. Then I'm going to cut my thread off. Okay, I'll put my thread aside. Now I'm going to hold this as black. Ultra 70, which we're going to use to tie on the legs and stuff. So I'm going to tie it on there, run this down to the bend, just come back up a little bit to the back, and then cut the thread off. Like so then I'm going to get a bristle from a brush. This is a brush bristle. Just cut them off a, of a brush. This one's a nice black one. And tie this on right on the very top of the shank. And you down the bend like so. Alright. Next we're gonna put on eyes, which is just a little pre-made eyes. You can just figure eight that on there. It's a little awkward here but get it centered where you want it like so play around a little bit here it cooperates there we go okay now what I'm gonna do is I'm going to uh, just let that hang there now and I'm gonna take a red marker I'm going to mark this white. I'm going to turn it to red. Okay. I could have built that up a little bit more, I think, but I think that would be all right. Okay. Now you got that on there. Now what I'm going to do is put some UV resin right on the top there like so Not too much and I can put some between the eyes too try not to get too too much on there if you have to do it twice it's probably better than putting too much I might have put a little too much you can see how it drools so I'm just going to get my bodkin here and just Careful not putting it in your eye. Of the hook, I mean, not your eye. Okay, just kind of let it drool so it's shaped the way you want it. And put the light on it, and it should harden it up pretty quick. There, okay, so that's it. That's that. Okay, now we got that done. Okay, next thing we're gonna do is we're gonna put some legs on this guy. He's got three sets of legs. So I'm gonna put this one here just behind the eyes first. Use a fairly long, just the full length here. Just cross like so. 
I'm just going to bend these forward like this. Oop, and wrap thread in behind the eye. That'll help hold it in position, like so. Okay, got that one. Now we'll put another one on behind that one. it there okay so then we're gonna put a third one on right in the very back same thing we're gonna figure eight this guy on here like so oh just gonna pull them to the back center one will just leave straight legs on there kind of looks like a scary looking critter okay now the next thing we're gonna do is put his wings on so we got some grizzly hackle here it's just some nice small fine stuff it's the tips we're just gonna use the tips I'm gonna tie it on with the shiny side up like so a couple of turns and pull them back shorten it a little bit like so see that there it's like so okay one more wrap there now I'm gonna take one more of course it's got two wings so we need another one I'm gonna put him on there same thing there now I'm gonna go in front of those center legs and tie it some more make sure it doesn't come loose make sure they're even okay now what we'll do is we'll cut this off here and this one off like so that's good and tight on there. You can figure it around those legs if you want it. Okay, there we go. Okay, next thing we're gonna do is we're gonna get a little bit of this black dubbing, just a tiny little bit, and we're gonna dub it here. And we're gonna dub it between the eyes. Like so behind the eyes it's kind of covering up all the thread and stuff here it is going to hide all the parts you tied in here and a wee bit more center legs like so okay now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna whip finish it right there and watch those legs there 
here we go. I'm gonna cut that off there, like so. Then what I'd like to do is put a tiny little bit of uh, super glue on there. Just to make sure those don't let go there. Just a tiny little dab. That should do it. Like so. Okay, now we got the wings on. We're gonna shape these legs. So that takes a little bit of playing around to do. It doesn't look too bad. So he's already got us once. Okay, now the next thing we're gonna do is shape the legs. Okay, now that's the feeler there. The front there is biting tool. Now I'm just gonna take this part here and bend it upward like so. Okay, just this stuff bends pretty good. And get all of it. Try and make them even on each side. I can. Then I'm gonna go close to his eyes and bend him down like that. Same thing on this side. Doesn't go perfect, not to worry. We can adjust it anything we want. Something like that. Okay, that might be a little bit long, so if it's too long, what we'll do is we'll just shorten them up a little bit, like so. And you can kink them back the other way. I'm going to put on a little kink in this one here too. Just to shorten it up. And then close the eye, bend that down. It's almost like feelers. These ones. Okay. Got a stinger there. I'm going to bend him. Okay, next we're going to do middle leg. Let's basically do the same thing. I'm going to about the length of the body and put a kink in upward like that okay and then I'm gonna put one close to the body actually that might not quite be good there Probably a little long so I'm gonna take it and shorten that up a little bit something like that and closer to the body put a little kink down and with this one so I'm just gonna adjust it. If it's not right, you can adjust the way you want. Okay, that one there is pretty close. Okay, bend this a little bit more here. And there, like so. Now I'm gonna cut this off. There, and there. off there so I'm gonna put a little kink okay something like that a little leg on there come on alright okay there he goes now the back ones basically the same idea these ones are gonna be longer And then down a little bit. I get them fairly even. Okay, now I'm going to cut these ones off. Watch the wing there. About there. And this one, like so. It gives them some little feet there. So there we go. Now, the other thing I want to do is we'll get some super glue and put super glue on the legs. Careful the wings. That will keep them in position. Because it bends fairly easy, that material. 
else. So this would keep the position. Surprising how well it works. Got a little blob there, it's okay, it looks more realistic. So there you go. There's your guy. And gotta watch this part here. That's the stinger. Okay. Hope you enjoyed that. Mosquito. We're ready to get you.